at this, Hobbs. I could order an official chocolate frosted sugar bombs beanie. See, it has a battery powered propeller on top and a big star on the front. Isn't that neat? You have to send in four box proof of purchase seals to get it, it says. Well, don't just stand there or this will take forever. Ugh, this stuff always makes my heart skip. Blick, I feel sick. Oh, come on, that's only your second bowl of cereal. This stuff is pure sugar, but it's fortified with eight essential vitamins, so it's good for you. Give me a break, this is like eating a bowl of milk duds. Look, it says right on the box, part of a wholesome, nutritious, balanced breakfast. And they show a guy eating five grapefruits, a dozen bread muffins. You know why you shake like that? Vitamin deficiency, I'll bet. Morning, Dad. How's your breakfast? Fine. Oatmeal, huh? A bowl of pasty, bland, colorless sludge. Yes, why don't you go describe your own food somewhere else? I bet you'd rather have a bowl of tasty, lip-smacking, crunchy on the outside, chewy on the inside, chocolate-frosted sugar bombs! Can I pour you some? No, thanks. I'm trying to reach middle age. What are you having, Mom? Boring old toast and tea? You want the beanie? You eat the cereal, Calvin. One and a half boxes to go and I'll have enough proof of purchase seals to order the propeller beanie they offer. One and one third boxes to go. Man, I'm earning this. Hobbs, I did it! I ate enough boxes of cereal to get all the proof of purchase seals I need. Now I can order my beanie. Oh boy, I can't wait to get it. I'll be so cool! Not for over a month. It says to allow six weeks for delivery. Six weeks? I'll be old then! And I'm sure your beanie will be the talk of the rest home. Mom! Mom! Did my beanie come in the mail? Are you kidding? I just mailed your order this morning. I'm never going to make it six weeks. Gosh, I can't wait to get my beanie. I hope it comes soon. Do you think it will? It's probably been almost six weeks by now, don't you think? I ordered the red beanie, but what if it's not in stock? Should I take the blue one or wait for them to reorder? A blue one would be okay, I guess, but I ho sure hope they have a red one. I've always wanted a beanie like this with a propeller. Boy, it'll be so cool when I have it. I can't wait. Wow, a red beanie or a blue one. Do you think it will come tomorrow? Do you? It is sure better. Yeah, that's how I feel, too. How was school today? Oh, it was a blast! Did my beanie come today? Please let my beanie come today. I promise it won't ever be bad again. I'll do whatever you want. Please, please, please! I'll never ask another favor if today's the day I get my beanie. Did I get my beanie? Nope. What's it take, huh? I can't believe this. Every day I get all my hopes up thinking my beanie will come, and then it doesn't. And for each day that goes by, I figure the odds are better that it will come the next day. So my hopes get higher and higher before they fall. It's awful. But I've been disappointed so often, now I'm finally getting numb to it. E.B. the mailman made a second trip today and delivered it in the last five minutes. Wow, I never thought of that! Come on! He's not numb. The longer you wait for the mail, the less there is in it. I'm home. I didn't get my propeller beanie today, did I? As a matter of fact, you did. It's here! Ha <laughs> ha! It took weeks and weeks of waiting, but at long last it's here. Now I finally, finally get to put it on! Some assembly required. Batteries not included. Can you believe this? I've got to assemble my beanie propeller and motor myself. What do they think I am? An Engineer, look, I've got to insert these wires and this plastic switch. I can't do this. Here, let me try. No, get away. I'll do it. You'd probably goof it all up or nip. Oh, no. See, insult a tiger and you get bad luck every time. My motor broke. The piece snapped. Now my beanie propeller won't work. Ah! I waited weeks for this and now it's broken and I didn't even get to wear it. Stupid rotten piece of lousy junk. It's all your fault! Arrgh! My fault? I was just sitting here. You broke it. You willed me to break it. You did some subliminal thing. Don't deny it. I know you did. You must have. Okay, now I'm willing you to go jump in the septic tank. What are you mad at me for? Get away from me. I don't even want to talk to you. You broke your beanie motor, not me. I didn't do anything. 
You distracted me. I did not. I was just sitting here. You broke it all by yourself. <laughs> all right, I know. But considering my life's in shambles right now, couldn't you at least take the blame? Dad, can you fix my beanie? I broke the propeller motor trying to put it together. Well, let's see. This isn't too bad. Just snap the battery case. I'll just glue it together. Insert the switch for you, okay? There, good as new. Now just let this sit a while so the glue can set. You did it! You fixed it! I can't believe it! Hey, Mom! Dad fixed something! He did? Your dad? All right, that's enough. Look, Hobbs, Dad fixed my beanie. Well, how's it look? Adjectives fail me. I'm turning it on. Ready? Here goes. I don't seem to be lifting off. This is very peculiar. That's the word I was looking for. I'm not flying. This beanie doesn't make me fly. What's the point of a propeller beanie if you can't even fly when you wear it? Not style, certainly. What a ripoff. I ate all that cereal, waited weeks and weeks to get the beanie, assembled it myself, and the dumb thing doesn't even fly. At least it's not a total loss. It came in this great cardboard box. Oh boy, now we'll have some fun.